Former 90 Day Fiancé star Julia Trubkina announced that she has a new job in America. Russian woman Julia was working as a go-go dancer in South Korea when she was introduced to Brandon Gibbs by his friend. On the first day that Brandon spoke to her, he decided to make Julia his wife. After Brandon took trips to meet Julia, the couple was soon engaged and she moved to the U. S. on AK-1 visa. Julia never expected to be staying on a farm, let alone having to sleep in separate bedrooms because they were living with Brandon's parents. Julia cribbed about having to wake up early and working with animals, but the tables have turned now. Julia, who had a strained relationship with Brandon's parents during 90 Day Fiancé Season 8 has now become close to them. The same Julia who kept threatening Brandon that she'd go back to Russia if they didn't move out of Betty and Ron's house now makes fun Instagram content with her in-laws. Although the couple has recently moved to Virginia Beach, they keep visiting Ron and Betty in Dinwiddie, and Brandon has also received a promotion in his pest control job. Fans have been watching Brandon and Julia on 90 Day Diaries, but when asked why they aren't in the cast for 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After, Season 7, Julia said she was cut for being from Russia. The last time that Julia spoke directly to her fans on Instagram, she'd shared that she was facing deportation. As per Julia, her green card was expiring because they had to apply to adjust her status which they hadn't. While Julia has refrained from mentioning the subject again, which suggests everything is probably fine now, she created a reel on Thursday to talk about her new job. Julia has managed to turn her hobby, into a job. She has been helping Brandon's dad Ron in training and caring for dogs. I began to understand that I was not bad at it, Julia wrote in her caption for the video which showed her and Ron training a German Shepherd puppy. Julia proceeded to reveal an unknown fact about Pillow Talk cast member Ron. As per Julia, Ron has a lot of experience in dog training. He has also traveled to Europe for championships. Julia has been absorbing a lot of knowledge from her father-in-law. She's also been attending courses and reading about her new job. And now I work as a dog trainer. I constantly want to learn something new, she proudly added. In Julia's comments, fans wished her congratulations and some asked her if they could get their dogs to her for 90 Day Fiancé star Julia to train. Absolutely send me a message please, was Julia's prompt reply. Those who've watched Julia since 90 Day Fiancé season 8 know how enterprising she is. Julia started working at the age of 13. She has done as many as 15 jobs when she was back home. Julia's resume boasts of her career as a professional dancer, waitress, babysitter, administrator, saleswoman, hookah girl, fitness instructor, writer, designer, and more. She can now add one more job to her list. Apart from running a farm, Julia's in-laws make a living by breeding dogs. Ron and Betty have been accused of running an alleged puppy mill business. Fans have spotted caged dogs in some of Brandon and Julia's 90 Day Fiancé episodes in the past. Julia, who's defended Brandon's parents before, might just use her qualification as a dog trainer now to prove 90 Day Fiancé fans wrong. Source, Julia Trubkina, Instagram.
my breath all 